My name is Jason Conrad. I am the owner of the Salem Capitals professional basketball team here in Salem. The Salem Capitals are part of the TBL, the Basketball League, professional basketball league with 45 teams across the country. And we are excited to be here. After I had graduated high school, I signed a Division I scholarship with Portland State University, and I was super excited. I moved out here, was in the dorms, and with a week being in the dorms, I just fell into a major slump emotionally, and I didn't know what was going on. I didn't know how to navigate it. I didn't know what steps to take, and I didn't know if I should let people know or not. It was this, I was a high-profile male athlete, and I wasn't supposed to be emotional about things. And I eventually just reached that point where the water just kind of tipped over the edge and I had to make the decision to walk away from Portland State. And I literally went from the coach's office letting them know I couldn't do this anymore to the hospital. And I was diagnosed bipolar and then a whole new journey started. The biggest thing for me is I just didn't want to be a burden to people. And so I didn't want the help and I didn't ask for the help because that was my first thought was, I don't wanna drag people down with me if I'm gonna go down. And I've definitely learned from these experiences that once my mind is made up about something, it's real hard to change it. And that was probably my biggest learning experience over this entire journey, you know, which is still going on, um, that it's okay to ask for help and that people genuinely wanna help you. Basketball, just like, cooking, drawing, writing. Um, it kind of just became my sanctuary and I'd be out there and basketball on more than one occasion has literally saved me. And so to be able to have it come full circle and be in the position I'm in and be able to use basketball as a platform, not only for the community engagement, but for me to be able to build upon that community engagement and use that platform to promote this mental health awareness, I think is the most important thing to me. And that's you know, I don't want to say that's what I'm most excited about. I think as a whole, I'm just excited all around, but it's something I'm really looking forward to, you know, implementing and building on. In the back of my mind, I always have that what if. And I totally could have done bigger and better things, but I'm a very big, everything happens for a reason. And, you know, the adversity that I had to navigate in my past led me to this point, which is exactly where I want to be.